Hello, I just purchased the ultimate seat for my 2005 Honda VTX 1800. I'm How To Bob, I'm gonna show you what we have here. I'm gonna open up the box and we'll see what we have inside. First thing we have is a bunch of packing. Let's see, we have the optional seat cover. This is a ride-on seat cover. Keeps your seat dry. You can slide it over top of the seat, the seat back, the passenger seat, the backrest. Comes with all the covers you need to cover every part of the new seat that I just got. And it comes in a nice, convenient carrying bag. So let's get rid of all this packing here and see what else we have. Next thing I pull out of the box is the passenger seat. Very nicely made. Got the ultimate logo on it. Got the mounting brackets. Make it real easy to install. So there's the passenger seat. Let's take a look at the driver's seat here. Very nicely made again, the ultimate logo. It's got a lot of back support, all the mounting brackets that I need to install. A little tab here covers up the driver backrest insert. And it's ready to go. And here we go, this is the driver backrest slides into the slot I just showed you and then we have a little pouch for the back of the driver it velcros on for the passenger and then we have the passenger backrest it bolts onto the sissy bar from the back all right and we have instructions so let's get started we're going to start out by taking off the passenger seat there's two bolts one on either side right where the strap is so I take off both of those bolts the one on the left and the one on the right and then there is another bolt right in the very back center of the fender fender and once I get that bolt out I can then lift off the passenger seat set that to the side and start to take off the driver's seat. There's two bolts on either side. There's a bolt on either side, two bolts holding the driver's seat in. So I just remove one on the right, and I'll go around to the left, and do the same on that side, remove the one on the left. Okay, now that I have the two bolts, I, all I have to do is slide the seat backwards and you'll see a little tab here that slides underneath the gas tank and the two parts here that get bolted on. So here's my new one. I'm going to slide the tab underneath the tank again, push it down in there and line up my two holes on here and one on the other side. So I get that lined up, I can go ahead and reinstall my bolts. On either side of the seat get that tightened down and go to the other side and do the same thing got to push down and adjust the seat to make sure that the holes line up and once I get it lined up I can go ahead and tighten this bolt on the left side so next I'm going to install the passenger seat there's two little tabs here that have to line up and then the one in the back it goes on the fender so I set this on here and align it up put my bolts in and tighten them up one on the right and then I'll go around to the left side and do the same thing on the left side and tighten that one up that just leaves me the rear one here line that up and put my last passenger bolt in place and tighten that up now I'm going to do the passenger backrest so I just remove the three bolts holding that in and it just pops right off once I take out all three of the bolts and the new one comes with the new bolts already installed so I need to remove all three of the bolts that came installed on the new passenger backrest once I get those out should line right up to the sissy bar put that bolt in 
and I can go ahead and tighten them up slightly. I don't want to get them real tight. I want to leave some space so I can move it around. Don't want to get them real tight yet. Then once I get all three of them in and get them lined up, I'll go through and tighten all three of the bolts for the passenger backrest. All right, now I've got that tightened up. I'm going to install the driver backrest, and this is a real easy install. I just lift the Velcro tab and slide the driver backrest down in, and that's adjustable. Folds forward and everything. Next, I'll install the passenger baggage area here. A little tote that Velcro's on the back of the driver backrest. And you can see how the ultimate seat looks on a 2005 VTX 1800. I'm How To Bob. Thanks for watching.